right, fierce fans, moving right along. Our next fight of the evening is sponsored by Sun Key Realty. They help with purchases, listings, and new construction as well as land. Call Sun Key Realty to set up an appointment to discuss creating a plan for you. When this fight begins, the referee in charge will be Tyler Tomlinson. This fight is scheduled for five three-minute rounds for the Fierce Fighting Championship Amateur Women's Strawweight Title. Introducing the first fighter to the cage, fighting out of the blue corner. She holds an amateur record of three wins and two losses and weighed in at 115 pounds. Fighting out of Team Barber, MMA, and M80. Fierce fans, make some noise and welcome to the cage, Ludi Alves! Mais a gente rala, mais a gente cresce Hoje estou feliz porque eu sonhei com você E amanhã posso chorar por não poder te ver mais O seu sorriso vale mais que um diamante Se você vier comigo aí nós vamos adiante Com a cabeça erguida e manter a fé em Deus well, it was a right hook that hedged Ludi Alves's chances at fighting for her first ever MMA belt. And tonight takes on her toughest test yet in Hannah Silva. Ludi, coming in from Boca Raton, Florida, but not her first rodeo in Utah. Jason, we saw as Ludi showcased her striking back in October with a big win over a tough opponent. What makes her so good? She was great. Her counter punching was phenomenal that night. She was kept landing those shots, kept landing the jab, kept, kept landing that counter shot. She, her striking is phenomenal. We'll see if she gets tested on the ground tonight against Hannah Silva. I, I think one of the underrated things about Ludi Alves is that she has a chin of granite. She went up against a very tough striker in Mina Yushirawadi, and she stood with Mina Yushirawadi, who has some of the best striking in the entire state, and had some clean shots on her as well. She did. She did very. She was phenomenal. She ate the shots. That she, she ate the shots. She countered them. Let's see what she brings to the table tonight. We don't have a lot of data on Ludi Alves. We know she has a record of three and two. Her fourth fight was against Mina back in October. She had a fifth fight in December, which she lost via TKO in the second round. Nonetheless, she gets her chance at the first ever Fierce Fighting Championship women's title here tonight at 115 pounds against a tough as nails Hannah Silva, Ludi Alves, out of American Combat Gym in Boca Raton, Florida. History in the making tonight. Entering now is Ludi Alves. Her opponent, Hannah Silva, waiting in the wings. We're going to bring her out right now. All right, before we introduce the next fighter, I want you guys all to be aware, this is the first women's belt or title fight for Fierce Fighting Championship. So we have got to make some noise when these gals get after it tonight. I guarantee you, this is going to be a battle. She came from Florida. She's coming from St. George to get this belt, the very first women's title. So we got to make sure that we make some noise for them. And introducing her opponent, fighting out of the red corner, she holds an undefeated amateur record of three wins and zero losses and weighed in at 115 pounds. Fighting out of St. George MMA, Fierce fans, make some noise and welcome to the cage, Hannah Silva! Well, if you look up Utah's pound-for-pound -pound <laughs> rankings, the number one amateur straw weight is Hannah Silva. Number two is her opponent tonight, who has already made the walk, Ludi Alves. Two of the best that Utah has to offer, battling for the first female belt ever in the fierce cage. Silva's amateur career has seen early successes with two finishes and a unanimous decision leading to an undefeated record. Jason, you do commentary, but you are also involved behind the scenes quite a bit. How exciting is it for Fierce to be crowning their first ever female champion here tonight? What a great opportunity for Utah MMA to crown the first Utah Bantamweight champion. Man, it was a Bantamweight, right? Strawweight, my fault. Well, excuse me, sorry about that. Uh, this is phenomenal. It's great for the sport. It's great for Utah MMA. I hope to see it just keep progressing from here. Interesting stat about Hannah Silva, BJJ Purple Belt, her fiance 
Morgan College is also a fighter. The two of them have been fighting alongside each other for a couple of years now. A fantastic fighter off of her back. Her body lock takedowns are second to none. The combined record of Hannah Silva against her three opponents in the past is one and one. Leading into Ludi Alves, Ludi has seen more action than any of her opponents before. So this is going to be her toughest test yet. Yeah, we'll, we'll see how she handles the pressure because we know Ludi's going to bring it. You know she's going to stalk her and walk straight forward. We'll see how she handles that pressure. She does have that jujitsu background, so I'd like to see once she gets gets the fight, if she can get the fight to the ground, how does Ludi respond to that? Two wins in 2022, leading to her chance at the strawweight strap here for Fierce Fighting Championship. Her second fight was back in May, a win via unanimous decision over Sam Daybell. Her third fight back in October of 2022, a win in the third round by a triangle over Chloe Baker. Hannah Silva versus Ludi Alves. Alves, two years senior, two inches taller, and a record of three and two versus Hannah Silva's undefeated three and oh. Silva fighting out of St. George MMA. Ludi Alves out of Team Barber. Hannah was smiling her whole, her whole walk in. Hannah was smiling. She had a big smile on her face. She looked super confident. Both of these fighters talented wherever the fight may go. This fight is brought to you by Sun Key Realty. All right, guys. Like I said uh, in the pre-show, I feel like the women fights are always very exciting. You should expect some fireworks in this one. Rudy Alves in the black. Silva in the pink and white. In on the takedown for that body lock. Silva must have done her homework. Is Silva. For the first ever Looking female for that trip. straw weight championship for Fierce Fighting Championship. These ladies just relentless trading back and forth. In on that. Single leg is Silva. Silva getting the takedown. Ludi on the bottom. Silva applying pressure on top. Great to side control. This is where I wanted to see what what did, what is Ludi going to present off off her back. And she looks like she's fighting it. And now Silva's taking the back. Silva, a purple belt in jujitsu. Ludi receiving her blue belt last year. On the back of Alves. Couple of strikes blocked there by Ludi Alves. And Joel, is Hannah a little high here? I think she might be a little bit too high. I'd like to see her kind of sink her hips back just a little bit and uh, then kind of posture up and then rain some punches down and then attack the choke again. Maybe try to get uh, Ludi to tripod up so that she can maybe sink her hips back. Able to maintain control and get a better position here is Hannah Silva punching her way into potentially that rear naked choke. Position for that choke is Hannah. I feel like the game plan coming into this was Hannah to get this fight to the ground. Oh, absolutely. And from what we saw from Ludi from her last fight, it seemed like Ludi wants, definitely wanted to keep the fight standing. Hannah's executing her game plan she perfectly. Looks like she might have she that She might under get the chin. that choke through. Hannah, one submission win. It was her last fight back in October. It was a triangle in the third round. Looks like she's got it locked up. Now she's just looking to finish. That's tight. Hannah Silva with the chance to become the first ever female Fierce Fighting Championship champion. I believe it. Ten seconds left. I believe that chokes underneath the chin as well. Oh, there's, there's the tap. The tap. Ten seconds left. Wow. And history is made here tonight. Hannah Silva getting it done in the first round for the first time since October 17th of 2020. Way to execute that game plan there. 
way to stay patient on the back as well. Even though she, she was a little high there in the beginning, she adjusted really well, got her position back. Great finish. 4-0 and oh for the straw weight out of St. George MMA and is now the Fierce Fighting Championship straw weight champion. Congratulations to Hannah Silva getting the win over Ludi Alves. Fierce fans, referee Tyler Tomlinson has called us out to this contest at 2 minutes and 56 seconds of the very first round, declaring the winner by submission due to rear naked choke and new amateur strawweight champion out of the red corner, Hannah Silva. All right, come on over here, Hannah. Hannah, you made history tonight, the first ever Fierce Fighting Championship, strawweight champion. How are you feeling tonight? I feel great. I knew it was going to happen. It just, I know I'm the best, so I got to prove it tonight. So I talked about it on the broadcast, and we saw you walk out. You had a smile on your face the whole walk out. What was the game plan coming in here? Just have fun. I know my jiu-jitsu is good. I know it is. And I wanted to strike a little, but I know that the belt was on the line. Getting that easy submission, might as well get an easy finish so I can enjoy the night. Was there anything that surprised you from Ludi? I'm a little strong. I knew she was a good striker, so I worked on my striking, but I just saw the takedown, and that's what I was working on, that takedown, so I just went for it. So what's next? <laughs> just enjoy the night. I'm so proud of myself, and I'm proud of all the stuff I've done. Thank you for my family, my corner. I'm an independent fighter, 4-0. and oh, You can do it. You don't need a big gym. You don't need that big name coach. You just got to believe in yourself. I prove that right now. Is there anybody you want to give a shout out to tonight? My fiance, Morgan, my brother-in-law, Brody, and just my whole family, everyone watching at home, my cute niece and nephew. I'm excited to go show them this belt. My whole family, brother, sister, mom, dad. Thank you so much, you guys. I'm just so happy. Ladies and gentlemen, let's give it up for your winner and new Fierce Fighting Championship Amateur Strawweight, Hannah Silva.